Too often we live our lives thinking about the past or wondering about the future. And we ignore the only time that we can actually influence the present moment, the here and now. The past has happened, nothing we can do about that, it's in the past. The future will happen, but when it does, it likes to be the present moment. Think about that. So it's worth grounding yourself in the present, ideally all the time, but we're in the real world, so at least a lot more of the time than you're currently managing. Start by noticing when your thoughts drift away from what's happening now, and they, they do drift. They go all over the place, in fact, so this happens quite a lot. It's only part of being a human, really. So don't worry if you don't spot every instance, because you probably won't. Then take a step back physically, if it's safe to do so. So, basically, that sends a really powerful signal to your subconscious, but it's okay to stay, take that step back in your mind instead. That works pretty well as well. And then pay attention to what's happening now. Take the time to notice the sounds you're hearing, because they've been there all along, but you've basically, like a noise-cancelling headset, you, headset, you tuned out on them. Consciously listen, you'll be amazed what you hear. Then do the same with the things you can see around you. You'll almost certainly have a, why have I never seen that moment? That's something I've done in places I've been to hundreds or thousands of times. And I've managed to notice something new every single time. It's incredible, really. Then, depending on whether it's appropriate or not, do the same with smell and possibly touch. Smell should be okay, although if you sniff too obviously, you might get some funny looks from people. You might not, don't know. Touch depends on the situation, but I'm sure you can use your judgement on that. Doing that short exercise should bring you back to the present a lot, basically, because you've actually grounded yourself by doing it. And another option, one I use quite a bit, is to practice mindfulness. It's easy to do if you use help like the audio I've linked to below this video, it's especially easy. That's the lack of helping you stay more grounded and focused on the present moment, the here and now again. So if you'd like to be more grounded more often and experience all the benefits that that can bring, then hopefully you'll be living your life more fully for a start. Click the link below this video and start listening now. Go for it.